So, it's winter. And what happens to the crafty Nana in winter? She runs away. So, gone to find the sunshine and the warm um, to make me happy. Um, so I'm back in Malaysia at the moment. Uh, I'm planning all sorts of trips. I'm going to do all sorts of things. And I'm hoping that you'll find some of these things interesting. Uh, and I'm starting off, as you do when you get back and you've got a chance to go to one of your very, very favourite thrift shops, is show you a haul, a mega haul, a fabulous mega haul um, of clothes from Jalan Jalan Japan, the Japanese thrift store. And um, so there's going to be some kimonos in there. I'm just, just saying it out loud now. There will be some kimonos, but there's going to be some cool stuff. Um, and I'm starting with this first outfit and I found this top my daughter rolled her eyes at me like oh my god mother what are you thinking but it's got little touches of turquoise in it sort of very funky 19 sort of 60s vibe to it I've dressed it up all posh now this one came to 10 ring it 10 ringgit at the moment is about £1.76. pence. So, very nice bargain. I've just teamed it with a straight black skirt, a soft black jacket. Um, you could go a heavier jacket if it's very cold where you are. Um, I've added a little bit of bling to it. A lot of bling. A lot of bling. Um, but what I wanted to do is I wanted then to dress it down. So I'm going to come back and I'm going to show it to you dress down and then I'm going to dress it even further down so watch this space so number two taken away the black gone in for the soft grey to pick out the grey in the top gone in with a long grey jacket and switched my crazy collar necklace round to the silver side so another whole outfit Ba, 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 ba. Just now, as I said, we're going to go one step beyond. Try it even more. Tone down. See you in a minute. So, even further from being dressy. Um, so these trousers were... 15 ringgit, which is £2.61. Definitely a bargain. You know I like a pair of nice soft crop trousers just for the pure comfort of them. They do have pockets. And we do appreciate a pocket. Um, but I just think with this top, they are really, really funky. Very comfortable and very funky. You could stick a big grey cardigan over this or a big jumper. Pair of woolly socks, pair of Dr Martins. And you could go out the winter with in it too. So I think this is a really cool outfit. Not thrifted jewellery this time. Um, these I actually bought on the Sky Tower in New Zealand, in Auckland. And I love them. They're all um, shell and wood and very bohemian and very natural. And I thought they really worked very well with this outfit. So there we go. One top, three looks, all quite different funky. So, on to our next one. A while back we were talking about the 70s and the whole pinafore thing. This is a sort of more, I would have said this is more like an artist's smock. Um, it would be difficult to wear it without something underneath because the armholes are very um, voluminous but it means you get extra pockets. And it's a really heavy linen, so like really woven. And I just thought that this was seriously cool. And I feel quite sort of art teachery in it. Um, I've mixed it with the, the lovely blue floral um, just to lift it up. And I found in my stash of jewellery this um, stunning piece of old Chinese ceramic that's been made into a necklace and these are also um, old ceramic earrings. I actually found these ones in Singapore 
in a like a little old antique shop. Um, they are quite heavy, um, but they are rather gorgeous. So you know we'll forgive them for that. Um, so yes. I think this is a really, really, really useful top. I paid um, 10 ringgit for it. So again, £1.76. So reasonable. Because I know that I am going to wear this. And I know that I will actually get a lot of wear out of it. It's got a little bit of lint on it. I think that's the problem with it being um, quite a coarse weave linen. It does sort of pick things up a little bit. But, you know, I think that's part of the charm because it gives it that sort of hand-woven, sort of natural sort of look. So, I'm doing pretty good so far. We've got an awful lot more to come. So I better get straight on to the next outfit. But before I leave, I just want to say a quick thank you to all my new subscribers. I really struggled for quite some time to get views um, and suddenly you know I think the word is getting out there and so if you're one of those people that's told your friends if you're one of those people that's signed up and, and faithfully watches and tells other people thank you so much gosh I appreciate it, it makes me feel really good I can't tell you how much when you're making content and you're trying to make it interesting and you're trying to make it fun for people um, and you're putting your heart and soul into it, it really matters that people watch because it makes you feel, you know, that you're not wasting your time and that you're making a difference. And for those of you that comment, you know, saying things that like they, I surprise them with new ideas and give them things that like, that they can do that they'd never thought of doing, like follies and fangles, you know, thank you. Thank you so much. I really, really appreciate it. And it makes me feel validated. Now, next item. Okay, so this is the Wallace dress I bought back in England in the thrift shop, which I was very, very happy with. Then I saw this kimono and I thought, no, you can't put them together. That's just wicked. It's just too much going on. And then I thought, yes, I can. Yes, I can. I really can. I think this might have been gentleman's because it's quite muted in its colours. But I think it just looks amazing. Um, so... I have put them both together. Now, this was the very high end of what I bought. And it was a, one of those situations where actually there was a sign up saying that they were on special sale. And I, I went and I picked out and I found two that I absolutely loved. Uh, but when I got to the desk place and, I, and they charged me the full price. And I was a bit surprised and I said to them, but the, you know, the signs up, oh, they said that's left over from yesterday. Um, we've taken it down now. It wasn't supposed to be there. They are full price. Full price was 40 ringgit. 40 ringgit is £7.61. So I paid it. Because quite honestly, beautiful tailored kimono for £7.61. It's still worth it. Come on. But if I got it for 20 it would have been really fantastic. But anyway, so I like this. I think it's very cool. I'd go out of an evening in this if I had to go somewhere smart, quite happily. Um, and I've teamed it with my little inro, which is a little purse that they use um, all in sections and inlaid with um, mother of pearl. I just think it picks out all the colours in it. What do you think? Is that just too crazy? Or do you think the patterns actually complement each other very nicely? I just thought the whole tone, it almost looks like this is a bleached version of this, but it goes in a different direction. It's cool. So, on to the next outfit. Although I'm reluctant to take this one off, I've got to do another twirl, I love it so much. There we go. Funky or what? So ladies, my cameraman has told me we've got to the, we've already done enough and we've got to stop and do it part two. Um, I've got at least another five outfits, so that's probably a good idea because you'll start going cross-eyed. So I've put on my wild card outfit for this one. Um, I think it's going to fit, fit the bill for all my bright coloured lovers that um, like a bit of bohemian colourful style. I'm wearing my crazy colourful earrings that I found in Abbas Wistwith. Never say that properly. I'm a wist with. 
And this necklace came from Jalan Jalan Japan. It's another one that's £1.76. Um, I thought it looked quite cool with this. Now this was 10 ringgit. So that's, I think that was, again, that's one, is that 176 or one? Anyway, it's about that, yes. So it was a sundress. So it had the elasticated bit that's supposed to pull up over your bust. And then it was like a stick out little sundress with straps. No use to me whatsoever, but God, I love this fabric. It's got sequins, it's got colours, it's got everything going on. It's absolutely beautiful. Double frill around the bottom. It's exotic. Um, these both from England, the jacket and the t-shirt, but it makes a complete outfit. Um, I put some colour flowers in my hair just to keep the whole thing going. Make a fantastic day the dead outfit. Um, yes. I love it. It's wonderful. Cost me nothing. I had to put a sew a little zip in, but I did it by hand because I couldn't even bother to get the sewing machine out. So I just sewed a stitch to zip in and it goes from being a very useless sundress for me into being a really useful little skirt that I feel very flirtatious in. It's got a, certainly got a little bit of a twirl to it. So there we go. This is our wild card out, out, outfit. Um, I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. <laughs> uh, and I'll bring you the next five outfits in part two. And there are some more absolutely colourful, stunning pieces. So I think you'll enjoy it very much. Thank you again. Um, I think I've had 98 new subscribers this month. So again, I just want to say thank you so much for coming on board. Thank you for joining me. I do appreciate it so much. See you in part two.